Oh gee, I can't imagine why he would want his old life back. Basically unlimited money and limited her. <laughs> Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are said to be trying to mend their relationship with the British royal family. And people think that they're just doing this in a very shady way. Uh, Prince Harry is not born to the Hollywood sort of world. His, his upbringing was very much one of responsibility and duty. Meghan and Harry are reportedly doing this by getting closer to King Charles's youngest sibling. Prince Edward and his wife, Sophie. They're attempting to reconcile with Harry's distant family members and sort of weasel themselves back into the family. And this is according to entertainment commentator, Mark Boardman. And this is what Mark Boardman specifically said. Meghan and Harry have reconnected with Sophie and Edward, and this renewed connection may serve as a gateway back into the royal household. Hollywood expert Mark Boardman sheds light on the evolving dynamics within the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's relationship, highlighting the contrasting desires of Meghan Markle and Prince Harry regarding their future plans. However, there was one unnamed insider who stated that the rumors about Meghan Markle and Prince Harry reconnecting with Prince Edward and his wife Sophie are false. And according to this source, there have been no discussions or interactions between them whatsoever. Meghan loves Harry, but she wants to bring out the better side in him, Boardman continued. In any case though, Mark Boardman says that this is in fact true. And he said in a new report that despite a significant age gap, both couples have endured substantial public scrutiny over the years. Mark Boardman also stated that Sophie has been a close confidant for Prince Harry and recent interactions between the two couples indicate their ongoing connection. Harry and Meghan have become especially close to Prince Edward and his wife Sophie since King Charles became king in September of 2022 after Queen Elizabeth II's passing. God save the king! And royal expert Richard Fitzwilliams mentioned that Harry and Meghan's friendship with Edward is relatively recent. In the past though, Queen Elizabeth had hoped that Sophie would assist Meghan Markle in adopting to royal life, although a close relationship never really developed from there. And Richard Fitzwilliams, he went on to add, neither were born royal, both, especially Meghan, have suffered from press harassment. Both had ambitions to combine being royal with other activities after joining the royal family and found it was not possible. So you can kind of see why Meghan and Sophie could have a close connection, or maybe there was hopes that a deeper connection was gonna be formed because they have very similar stories and experiences. But in general, Harry and Meghan have been distant from King Charles as well as Prince Williams and other members of the royal family since stepping back from their roles as senior working royals in 2020. And that was only two years after their wedding. They moved to Montecito, California with their two children, Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet, and have been openly critical of the royal family since then. They notably did a revealing interview with Oprah Winfrey in 2021, and Harry released his harsh memoir titled Spare in early 2023. Before that, they even released a documentary detailing their issues with the royal family. And later in 2023, Harry briefly visited the UK on the anniversary of his grandmother, Queen Elizabeth II's passing, before heading to the Invictus Games in Germany. I know exactly one year on that she is looking down on all of us. And surprisingly, he didn't stop by Balmoral Castle to see his father, King Charles. And this was despite being invited by King Charles. And then after the Invictus Games, Harry and Meghan went on a secretive trip to Portugal with Princess Eugenie and her husband, Jack Brooksbank. It's reported that Prince Harry is close with Princess Eugenie. While King Charles is willing to reconcile, it does appear though that Prince William and Princess Catherine aren't really open to connect with Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. But guys, we can see that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are trying to make their way back in, trying to make connections with royal members in some way, shape or form. And this is looking like it could literally be a gateway for them to actually mend their relationship with the royal family, which is not necessarily a bad thing, but from the looks of it, they have their favorites within the royal family that they're interested in connecting with. And for the others, 
uh, doesn't seem like Meghan and Harry are interested. But who knows, I could be wrong. There could be some type of reconnection in the future. I'm always hopeful, I'm always a little bit optimistic of things working out, but from the looks of it right now, doesn't seem like they're gonna reconnect and reconcile things with the entire royal family. But that's just my two cents on it, guys. Be sure to let me know your thoughts down below. Thanks for hanging out with me here on FTD News, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Boom.